Thank you for joining the REI funding page for another pro team interview. Um, we are happy to have Tanya Smitherman on the call today. Um, she is a wealth of knowledge in the real estate industry. She's out of Birmingham and she is a top investor friendly agent, um, but she's a lot more than that. She is a part of a, a bunch of boards well connected throughout the Birmingham area. Um, licensed real estate agent, certified um, investor friendly agent. And I'm probably missing a whole uh, slew of things, Tanya, but um, I'm happy that you're hopping on the call with us today and uh, sharing a little bit of your time and sharing a little bit of your knowledge. And so thank you so much for being here. My pleasure. Thank you for having me. Yeah, absolutely. Well, let's, uh, we always like to start off this interview by just uh, having you tell us a little bit about yourself, where you're from, you know, your family, your hobbies outside of real estate. Yeah. Tell us kind of a little bit about yourself. OK, awesome. Again, Tanya Smitherman. And I am originally from Alabama. I grew up in the Shelby County area, Alabaster. I moved away for a stint, then I moved back. So I've lived um, in the Mountain Brook area and now I reside in Maylene on the other side of Alabaster. Awesome. Awesome. Well, that is always a plus having someone here is, here is local to Alabama, grew up here, knows the market. Um, that's a huge plus. So transition into the, the real estate industry. Tell us how long you've worked in the real estate industry, how long you've worked with investors, kind of your story of getting into that and, you know, your expertise of understanding what you do and and what you do now and that that invested investing journey. OK, awesome. So I have been investing in real estate for now, um, right about 12 years, and I actually started out as an investor. So before I even got my license, I was a real estate investor and doing fix and flips. And I saw the value in getting my real estate license for my business as a real estate investment company. But lo and behold, I did not know that I was going to uh, get bit by the, the bug and want to um, help others. Now, I've always been a person to help others, but that was not the reason I got my license. And then once I got into it and I started helping others, I absolutely loved it. And that um, turned into so much more. And I was like, OK, me as an investor from the investor standpoint and me as an agent from the agent standpoint, how can I marry the two? Because I knew that a lot of investors they were, you know, employing real estate agents to help them, but the agents didn't really understand the numbers. Mm -hmm. They could open up doors, could send them what's on the MLS, but they really didn't understand the ins and outs of looking at the properties from an investor standpoint. So I was like, oh, this is a niche because mm -hmm. I am an investor, I am an agent, and I understand the numbers. So um, I believe in education. And mm -hmm. uh, I started as an agent. There was um, an investor agent certification course that I took and I absolutely loved it. And so I um, from there, me and my business partner, we started doing investor meetups. And so in the investor meetups, we would teach investors how to invest and also how to work with agents. And mm -hmm. we were also agents how to work with investors so the meetups um they were awesome and then from the meetup uh we started doing boot camp because the investors like well we want a little bit more information and so we started doing boot camps and then from the boot camp we started asking people well why don't you guys teach real estate and teach the investor agent standpoint yeah. and um, it, we um, actually opened up a real estate school, which we currently have. And in our real estate school, which is Batson Associates School of Real Estate, we offer pre and post license for agents and brokers and CE classes. But we also offer investor workshops as well. Yeah, that is so awesome. 
um, you know, how you and I got connected uh, several months ago, you were the featured speaker at REI Live in Birmingham. And right. you spoke on investor friendly real estate agents and, you know, talking about that journey and, you know, both the how an investor needs to communicate with the agent and how the agent needs to communicate with the investor. Because that is, you know, from my experience, I've been investing for about six years and a lot of the times you know agents get a bad rap when it comes to investing because like you said it's you know most agents are on just on the residential sell and buy side not investing side and so right. there is a huge need out there for real estate agents who understand investing and can fill that void because there's a huge opportunity out there um, one, to, to make a lot of money, to help feed deals to investors. And then one, two, you know, the agents that need to invest themselves, they know this market. And so um, you put on a great presentation. And so you're what I hear, too, is as that journey, you're all about providing value and helping. Um, yes. And that's what I loved. I could sense that from your presentation at REI Live, um, that you share that same core values um, that is needed in the real estate space. It's a, an abundance mindset because if you can help people along their journey, you know, it's always just going to come back to you in some form of fashion. And so, um, I'm, yeah, I, I love your mindset and, and your um, willingness to help people learn and grow and help walk them through that journey. Um, that's much needed. Um, so, Transitioning that, what do you what do you like about working with investors? Um, what I like most about working with investors is I am very analytical myself and I love the numbers. So I love just looking at a deal and seeing, is it a deal? Mm -hmm. So again to end, but seeing the whole process from just conception to actual product, right? Yeah. Um, with investors, it's not emotional. Mm -hmm. It's really the numbers. That's <laughs> right. Because the person that works with me. Yeah. And I love that. Yeah. That's fantastic. Um, so what, you know, given your experience in the real estate industry, what are maybe a couple of tips that you could share that investors might find useful? Um. With just investing or working with agents? What I would say it, working with agents um, and then maybe a little bit investing, but yeah, primarily working with agents. That'd be great. So I would say for a tip for investors who are working with agents is just be very clear mm -hmm. on what your goal, you know, not that you're an investor, but what type of investing are you mm -hmm. looking to do flips? buying holes? Are you looking to, you know, wholesale? What are you looking to do? Because yeah. that will help the agent service you better. That's right. That's right. That's that's great advice because I've, you know, I, I hop on calls with potential customers looking to invest in deals. And that's my number one question. Like, what are your goals? Like, give me some clear uh, advice you know, clear picture of what you're trying to do, because that'll change your direction. Um, and then also just narrow down their focus. And so you're not maybe you're not wasting time sending this in, this agent out to look at properties for you or whatever. It's about not wasting time, having a clear focus, understanding what's going on. Most definitely. Yeah, Most definitely. that's great. Um, so. You have a lot going on. You've done a lot. You're a part of a lot of organizations. You you, you host these boot camps. Um, and I probably, I feel like I know this answer, but what could you tell the people that don't know you so far? What sets you apart from other investor-friendly agents out there? Um, I would definitely say that um, I believe in, and it's actually two mottos that we have. So believe in helping people do real estate by design. Mm -hmm. So we really specialize in what is it that the client is needing, right? Mm -hmm. And so I'm very flexible. I can go this route or I can go this route. So whatever 
um, I tailor it to the investor. Awesome. And then um, being a real estate solution specialist. So if yeah. they tell me this is my goal, then I'm going to help them achieve that goal. And I believe in being like the nucleus. So yeah. I work with a lot of different people. I can partner or marry together two clients yeah. and at solution specialists. So if I have an investor who maybe they are looking to get started in investing and mm -hmm. I have a more an investor who's maybe looking to unload some properties. Yeah. Then I know the price point of both. And I can mm -hmm. say, hey, let's do this. This the numbers work for you on both ends. Yeah. So you know, and, and I really feel like that sets me apart because I do a lot of networking. Mm -hmm. And so I am in front of a lot of different types of investors. Yeah. And I trade them together. That's right. You that yeah, you have been investing because there's, you know, there are I've met investor friendly agents that have never bought a property themselves. They can run the numbers, but they have never actually walked through that process themselves. And I know you have and you've taught people how to do that. You have a team with you at EXP Realty that do that specifically. So you are light years ahead. I, I know that from. Um, you know, you've, we actually just, we funded a deal for one of your team members, Tori, and you were helping her. I could see it, you helping guide her along. And that was, that's a huge benefit to that person. And so that's, that's wonderful. Um, so as we wrap this up, Tanya, how we're, we're going to post some contact information for you, but what is the best way if a person wants to get in contact with you, where should they go? So, um, of course, I'm on all the social media platforms um, and they can find me. Good deal. Well, we will be sure to post that um, at the end of this video and on the description in this video so they can get in contact with you. Um, well, that, that'll wrap it up, Tanya. And I, again, I appreciate your time, um, your expertise in the industry and, and willing to come on here, share your journey and what you do and the value you provide. Um, and uh, we really appreciate it. My pleasure. Thank you so much for the invite.